what's up and welcome back to my channel thanks for stopping by i am back at it again with another phenomenal torrid haul it's been a minute since i've done a torrid haul but you guys love torrid i love torrid you love when i haul torrid so i decided why not do another torrid haul so here we are. I don't know about you, but the area that I live in, many of the Torrid stores have now reopened, so it's been really refreshing to be able to go in store and browse and shop, and even a couple of them have been able to allow us to try on clothes again, which is kind of like so unusual and like something that I definitely took for granted before that now I don't. Um, so I picked up a few of these items in person and I picked up a few of these items online But everything that's available still on the website I'll be sure to link down below if you want to check it out for yourself as always I'll share my sizing for any of you who are new I do wear a US size 24 pretty universally in most brands and at Torrid I wear a size 3x more often than not in just about everything. Um, sometimes I go up to a 4X on bottom just because I am more pear shaped. So if there's not a ton of stretch or if I feel like I want something just a little bit more loose fitting on bottom, I'll size up. And I am pretty tall at 5'11", so keep that in mind as I try these items on. Without further ado, let's just get started with the first item, which is a very fun fall floral sweater it's like a pullover style it's not as soft as i had hoped it would be um i did pick this one up online so i didn't get to like touch and feel it in store but it is a little scratchier than what i would have loved from it to be honest and the inside isn't as soft and cozy as i had hoped either but it's still a beautiful piece it's got great fall coloring great fall floral throughout it's got a good amount of stretch in here, but it's not going to be like super stretchy like any of their soft knit items, if you're familiar with that at all. It's got more structure to it than those. It's got a nice cuffed sleeve. I was just drawn to this for the simplicity and just the good fall coloring and, and floral feature that it had. I did pick it up in the 3X or the 2224. I think it fit really well. It's, it's very comfortable. And although it's not as soft as I would have liked it to be, I do think that it's still a stunning piece and it's great, great for fall. I've said it before and I'll say it again, Torrid is hands down one of my favorite places to find awesome, trendy, comfortable quality footwear if you have a wide and extended size foot. I myself wear like a 12 wide more often than not. And Tor is one of the very few places I can shop. So I always look for unique new footwear options. And so when I saw these faux suede black wedges, I was like, yep, I'm going to need those. I have these in other colors, but I don't have it in black. So it's just your basic kind of wedge booty style here with the lace up front. There's not a ton of padding in here, but... I wore these around and I was very comfortable. The, the thing about these is that you have a little bit of a wedge on the heel, but it's completely like platform. So you're not gonna feel like you're wearing high heels all day by any means, they're very, very comfortable. And I do appreciate that they have the lace up the front so you can really secure these to the size of your foot. Overall, these are fantastic. I highly recommend these. They're a great option for fall and winter. And again, if you have like an extended size foot or a wide foot, these are perfect. Next up are these awesome workout pants. Oh, guys, I'm obsessed with this print. First of all, I love white. I love white, okay? I love it, I love it. But it's kind of scary to wear white bottoms, if you know what I mean. So I really appreciated that these have like so much pattern and print to them. So I was never gonna feel like I was showing too much or exposed in any way. They also have the fantastic pockets down the side that hold like your phone, your keys, your snacks, whatever you wanna put in here, it will hold. These are super stretchy, super, super stretchy. They're very comfortable. They come up high, they're like a high rise, but they are, are more of that like ankle or capri length, which I love. I adore these so, so much. I did size up to these in a four, 
just because with activewear I don't like it to be too too tight and I honestly think I could have gotten the three and been just fine these are still very comfortable but I do think that there could be a little bit more control in the waist which I always look for so just a lesson learned for me there but overall I'm obsessed with these they're definitely kind of like a springier pattern and print and color story but I'm here for it I'm totally gonna rock these all fall winter spring summer you name it I'm wearing it and I have no shame next up is this beautiful tank top and I'm obsessed with this because this is like the perfect color for me this is like my dusty nude color like dusty rose I think like this is my favorite color of all time. It's just so good and neutral. And I really like how there's this zip down the front and then it bells out into like a peplum. I find this to be so, so flattering. I really like too that there's a thick strap so you can absolutely wear a standard bra with this and be just fine. You're not gonna feel like you have to wear a strapless because your bra straps are gonna show or anything. It's got a nice thick strap. This one doesn't have much stretch to it. It's got a teeny bit of give like the teeniest bit so stay pretty true to size with this one I did pick it up in the size 3 or the 22 24 and I thought it fit really well there was a little bit of like pulling here um, right under the bust where it kind of bells out where I felt like it was just a little bit more snug than I would prefer but I also think that if I were to size up it would be too large so um, just keep that in mind the zipper is fully functioning too so you can zip this all the way down should you choose <laughs> Or if you want to unzip it just a teeny bit to have a little extra cleavage, you've got that choice too, which is fantastic. I think you can absolutely dress this up. You can dress this down. This is work appropriate. This is date night, girls night out. It has just so many versatile ways that you can wear it. So this is a winner for me. Super, super cute. Next up is this cute little like outfit that I put together unintentionally when I ordered these things. It's this cute like ribbed knit turtleneck tank. Very, very like lightweight, sheer, just good basic, good layering piece that you can really put with just about anything. And I love the like the turtleneck style with this without the sleeve so that you can layer it up and not get overheated during, you know, some of the warmer days of the season. So I really like that. It's stretchy. It's long. It's great. I picked it up in the size three. Fits like a dream. And to pair with it, I got this really cute khaki pleated knit skirt. This like khaki camel color is just so quintessential fall that I knew I was going to have to try it. Now it does come with a belt that's just like a fabric belt but no stretch in it. So this actually was like really tight on me. This belt runs a little small, if you ask me, um, compared to like the waistline of the skirt. So I opted not to use that belt and I put my own belt with it, which you'll see when I try it on. I think it looks really, really cute. But this skirt is so dang cute. It's got a stretchy waistband, which is great. No stretch in like the body of the skirt though, and it is a nice midi length. I love a good pleated skirt moment and I really appreciate that this one has belt loops so that you can either a, use the belt that it came with, or B, customize it with your own. And ultimately, like together, I think this is a really cute outfit. You can absolutely put like a jacket with it, or a cardigan, or wear it as is. It's definitely got potential for summer and fall, so I'm loving this. I picked the skirt up in the size 3 or the 22-24. I think I could have sized up and had a little bit more give in the waist and then the belt also might have fit better but the three fit just fine as well next up are another pair of shoes but this time they are leopard print loafers oh i love these i love these i love these i've already worn these a handful of times they are so comfortable and they are so chic they've got awesome gold detail here on the top of the loafer open backslide style good cushion here a little bit of a platform at the end these are just so great. I honestly think leopard print can be a great neutral if worn the right way. And so I adore these so, so much. I've worn them, like I said, a handful of times with some really chic, like neutral outfits or even with like a red dress and you wanna add a pop of statement, boom, here you go, here you go. I got these in the size 12 and they fit wonderful. Again, I can't say enough great things about Taurus footwear. 
Next up is this really cute lace tee. It's totally my color, this pink like dusty rose color. And it's just like a basic lace t-shirt. I love this, it's completely sheer. So you're definitely gonna wanna wear something underneath of it. I put just like a white tank top underneath of it. Probably not what I would opt for. I'd probably go with something a little bit less contrasting. But you get the idea of what this looks like in the try-on. It is stretchy and it's got a very nice feminine kind of like poofed sleeve. I'm a sucker for these kinds of sleeves. As you know, if you're not new to my channel, I love this sleeve. So this was really a no-brainer for me. It's a good basic, but it has so many extra like little details that take it to the next level. Like the lace the sleeve, even just the fact that it's cuffed with like a, a ribbed knit material, like all these little details just go the extra mile for me and I'm here for it. I did pick this up in the size three or the 22, 24. It fit wonderfully and this is just a great fall, summer, spring, really any season staple to add to your wardrobe. I love it. And last but certainly not least is my favorite piece from the whole haul. Oh, guys, this duster. Let me just tell you about this duster. First of all, it is the most beautiful fall color. Like this like warm, brown, rusty, like orange. I don't even know. It's so yummy and so fall. It's just, ugh. And then you want to talk about like the texture on the material here. And it is a silk material. This feels so luxe. So luxe. I felt really expensive when I wore this the other day. It was just, oh, so good. As you can see, I just recently wore it. So it does wrinkle, <laughs> keep that in mind. You're definitely gonna see some wrinkles as you wear this, but this is so stunning, so, so stunning. It does come with a cute little belt too, so you can either leave this hung open or tied shut in the front. I try it both ways and I love it both ways. Very comfortable, no stretch in this one, so stay very true to size with this. If you want it to be like fully like crossover jacket style, maybe go up a size. I did pick mine up in the three, which is kind of my tried and true size, and it fit great. I don't particularly go for the look where it's like folded over in the front and tied, kind of like a jacket. So this kind of like open in the front or closed with the belt style is perfect for me in the size three. The belt is great too, same texture, same material, just Tie it in the front, you're good to go. I love the length on this, it's a great length. It is just so chic, and seriously, I'm not kidding you, you feel like a million bucks when you wear this. This feels, looks, and acts way more expensive than it is, and I am obsessed, I am so obsessed. And that's everything that I got from my most recent Torrid haul. Thank you so much for tuning in and stopping by, I really appreciate it, I hope you've enjoyed what I found today. I always love to hear from you and your thoughts down below, so please let me know what you thought of the options that I picked out and if you had any favorites. Again, if anything, it's still available on the website. I will link it down below if you wanna check it out for yourself. And as always, if you enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up. That really helps me to know the types of content that you like here on this channel so that I make sure to cater to that going forward. Again, thank you so much for stopping by. I really appreciate it, and I'll be sure to see you in the next one. Bye.